Örebro Hockey Play presenteras av Tandvårdshuset på Storgatan 8 i Örebro samt restaurang Sapore. Rod, i måndags kom beskedet att du tar en plats i Lettlands OS-trupp. Hur ska det bli att representera ditt hemland i, i OS? I think it will be a lot of fun. Hopefully everyone gets there safe and healthy with all the situation we got going on in the world. But uh, hopefully when we get there, you know, the Olympic spirit kind of takes by itself and it will be a big honor and a lot of excitement. Du var inne på det just med coronasituationen. Hur har tankarna gått för egen del kring det? No, I mean, right now I think it's just you try to stay as safe as you can. Obviously wash hands, try to stay away from restaurants, uh, do the things you can do and then hope when you do the test, the PCR test before you fly that everything's good and I can get on the flight to, to go there and represent uh, not only the country but also I think Orebro is the only player from the team. Ni spelar i samma grupp som, som Sverige, inleder första gruppsmatchen mot, mot Sverige också. Um, vad har du för förväntningar på, på turneringen? Jag tror att det är en kort turnering. Varje game är viktig. Kanske det här är lite mer speciellt för mig för att jag spelar i Sverige de senaste par år nu. Och de har en bra bromma på det teamet. Kanske att de går under hans skin lite. Jag vet några av de här från DSH också. Det kommer att bli lite mer personligt, men jag tror att för oss är det en kort turnering. Det är en game. Så Every team can beat any team, especially now that any choppers are not coming. So I think uh, everybody is excited to play. I morgon är det äntligen får man nästan säga dags för för match igen efter några veckors uppehåll här. Hur hur ska det bli att att spela matcher i SHL? I I think everyone in the locker room is excited to play. Finally, we've been we've been practicing for feels like forever, and uh, during the year it's never fun. It's just the way it is. It's it's you know you usually have hard practices when you don't play for a week uh, to kind of keep that shape. So a lot of excitement. Uh, obviously, it'll be a little bit hard to get back into it, but we don't have a lot of time and the standings are tight. So it's uh, it's important to start good tomorrow and uh, kind of start to roll the snowball. Tre matcher på kort tid här. Hur hur känns den egna formen efter ja uh, som du säger några veckor med mycket träning? I mean, it feels good right now. Uh, games are a different animal, obviously, but uh, I think it's good that we have a lot of games right now. It's uh, we can kind of get a playoff mentality going right away and uh, build that up to the playoffs. Because, like I said, the standings are pretty tight, and uh, I think that's what our team is built for. It's the playoffs, and we have like a kind of playoff team, and I think it's it, it, it helps us definitely. Tre matcher på hemmaplan här direkt. Uh, vad betyder det att att få spela här hemma när vi startar igång igen? Yeah, it, it can be a good, good, uh, good help for us to, uh, like I said, get on the right side of the game. Uh, you know, it's only 1,800 fans, but it's still our fans, and we love playing in this rink. And also, it helps recovery-wise that we don't have to travel anywhere. We stay at home. You know, you can sleep in your bed and have all that stuff. I think it's all set for us to uh, to have a good start. And now it's up to us to go out there and deliver. Hallitrod, hold dig frisk och lycka till under veckan. Thank you.